One of the great mysteries of modern roadways is asphalt. I mean, what is it? It's not concrete. It has those little chunks all smushed together like a big pebble and chocolate cookie. And of course, you really don't want your bare feet to come in contact with it on a hot summer day when you're crossing the road to get to the beach. And this I may have some personal experience with. Well, now those blacktop roads could be green and they might become a mash of your plastic trash. Imagine the millions of pounds of unrecyclable plastics in the world. And now imagine them inside your community's roads. That's exactly what Toby McCartney and his team at McCreeber are doing. They granulate these plastics to create roadways all over the world. I spoke with Toby from his headquarters near Glasgow, Scotland. Hello, Toby, and welcome to Innovation Nation. Hey, Mo, thank you for having me. How did the idea to recycle plastic into roads come about? You know, the idea came about because I was at my little girl's school assembly and uh, the teacher had asked all the children what lives in our oceans and she put her hand up and she said, waste plastics. And I had one of those dad moments where I thought, I want to do something about it. That experience, plus hearing his mother-in-law complain about the pothole problem in her area, that Toby started innovating. Plastics are made from oil, the same source as bitumen. That's the black oily stuff you get in the road. So I tried to work out initially, how would I get the same chemistry in the waste plastics as that in bitumen? Well, it took 844 failed test results, but it was the 845th test result that I got the success with. How is it made? Yeah, so very simply, we select waste plastics from the waste stream, we chip them up, and then we add in what we call an activator. That mix is then paved into our planet's roads. Get this, one ton of Toby's company's product is equivalent to around 700,000 one-time use plastic bags, all going into the mix while also reducing carbon emissions. Thank you for being on our show. Thanks for having me, Mo.